Okay, so um, if I scared you, I'm sorry. Uh, this is going to be a foundation video, so I wanted to start barefaced. So all I have on right now are my eyebrows, which is pretty much all I put on if I'm having a no makeup day. So I'm going to start with a bit of moisturizer. I use the, uh, the Walmart brand of the Aveeno Naturally Radiant Lotion. I forget what it's called. And I just put it all over. I make sure when I'm going to be using the MAC Pro Longwear Foundation that I use a lot of moisturizer because I do have a few dry places and it can emphasize those dry places if you're dry. So rub that all the way down and we'll let that soak in for a bit and then I'll come back. Okay, so normally I would use my Fierne Velvet Gel Primer but I'm out of it and I haven't been able to order from the site. So I'm going to use a little bit of the NARS, I forget what it's called, it's in the white tube. It's a sample that I have. I'm just going to put that all over and let that soak in for a bit and then I'll come back and show you the foundation. Okay, now the next thing I'm going to do is apply my foundation. Now I did start out applying this foundation with a damp wedge sponge, but I'm lazy and it took too long. So I started using my fingers and it works just as well. So. I'm going to show you a little bit of how I did it with the damp sponge, but then I'm going to finish with my fingers. So when you use a damp, damp sponge, you don't want it to be wet. When you squeeze it, nothing should come out. If it does, it's going to be too wet and it's going to shear your foundation out too much. So just remember that. It'll make it easier. I'm going to take a little bit of foundation and then just pat it on. Now that's what I did for all over my face, so you can see it takes a while, but it gives a really nice finish. But fingers give just as good a finish with this foundation, so fingers it is. And I like to start in the middle. I know a lot of sites will tell you to start on the edges, but I feel like if the center of my face is flawless, then people might be fooled into thinking the rest is flawless as well. So, and then I blend, make sure you blend down your neck or else you're gonna end up with, you know, that crazy line at your jaw that everybody hates. And then when I'm finished, I like to just kind of press gently with my fingers to kind of I don't know, I feel like it sets it or something. Of course you don't have to do this. And don't buy my grody fingernails. They need to be repainted. Okay, so there's foundation. And that's about it. I powder at the end with whatever powder I want when I'm finished applying all the rest of my makeup. Usually uh, mineralized skin finish natural or a bit of silica or Cody loose powder. Just whatever I feel like using. So, I hope this video was helpful and thanks for watching and I hope I didn't freak you out too much with the bare face. Bye!